I am going on a summer holiday. A summer holiday, and I am going on a summer holiday. Who's gonna go with me? Who that girl with the beginning gift? Hey, what's up, everybody? They call me Red Q, aka the Hoofmaster. And right now, you're listening to AYA Radio, London, UK. Keep it locked one time, shall you? Nice one, brother. Nice one. We are engagement coordinators. Also known as a laga. We always make occasions great. We are joy and glamour. To the home of bride and bridegroom, we make sure we can sell them. May God make them productive and the union permanent. We are not there for competition, but to make their day groovy. Their happiness is our concern, even after today. May God bless you and me. May the good Lord replenish you Shoes for every morning spent today. Amen. So shall United Kingdom Association of Professional Wedding Engagement Coordinators of Nigeria. Up welcome UK chapter. We will fail with Sokoton Bella and go Badaria to Ayaya Dano and Bia Holy UK. Nothing fear, Bella Banco Coil and Rinne. Tell you for Pussy Takon, Mashala and Kowa, the way that you have to do your poor, but that you took Benny Way to Dano engagement. I want better to know the new Latin Buy Puma Bodusha, Bosha was a load of poor and you share one. And you have to know what it's your joint, but they put Bobo. Why you never let one yap of one good lady, a yap of one more for a good not the new two of buy a yap of why you any day, and my good way to why you get out of the way. I will never know what to do. I said to Talemu, who do anything to buy you by the Association of Professional Wedding Engagement Coordinators of Nigeria. Up welcome, you get chapter. Our general meeting holds on every first Monday evening at 7 p.m. For more information, call the president, Ken Michel Wadiku, on 07 932 or the secretary, Ume West, on 07 473 Up Association of Professional Wedding Engagement Coordinators of Nigeria, UK chapter, at an everlasting color to your memory day. Engagement coordinators, also known as a laga. We always make occasions great. We are joy and glamour. To the home of bride and bridegroom, we make sure we can sell them. May God make them productive and the union permanent. We are not there for competition. But to make their day groovy, their happiness is our concern, even after today. May God bless you and me, may the good Lord be plenty, shoot for every morning spent today, amen, so shall it be. Astamine promotes good health in adults and children. With Astamine, vitality and vigor is promoted, especially during hard work and sports. Also, Astamine helps fast recovery from illness. With essential amino acids and vitamins in Astamine, your body will perform optimally. You can find Astamine in all registered pharmaceutical shops across the country. Astamine, the building blocks of good health of the family. Astamine, marketed by Fitson Healthcare Limited, the company that values life. I'm a bush in law, you can't even tell why. I'm saying I'm chilling with DJ Ali. On fair no she lied to both, you know, see well. And on your forty, see you are. On fair no she lady, I see more simple, be trying this time. You will get burned, burned, burned. Yeah, DJ Ali, big TV. I'm a bush in law. Shout to everyone, east, west, south, north. Okay, 
Thank you so much for coming. Yes, 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 you are. Huh. Happy Sunday to all our listeners and viewers all around the world. Yes, it's happening as we broadcast. The marathon is on. The battle is going on. So please try and avoid uh, Central London, especially Jamaica Road, uh, coming down to Rhoda Hyde. You know, that is where the... Um, traffic is going to be i'm telling you there's going to be a lot of traffic chaos i think it's 10 miles marathon today in london london is little trust me yes ladies and gentlemen welcome to your friendly radio show um the role model show live on ayo radio uk how are you all doing today yes well, thank you so much for your patronage and uh let me just remind you that we are actually live 
on um, Instagram Live. That's AYO Radio UK Instagram Live. It's right here. And right here we have the uh, popular Facebook Live. Okay. Um, today I have the honor to interview the Nollywood actor. He's very famous. He's also a model, TV personality, and a philanthropist. He goes by the name Junior Pope. Junior Pope Onduodo. Onduodo. Okay? Ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready. It's going to be an interesting interview. Get yourself ready. Be prepared to be enlightened and motivated and encouraged by the Nollywood actor, Junior Pope. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now going live with Junior Pope. I'm connecting him now live on AYO Radio UK. Thanks so much to all our listeners and viewers and shout out to yourself, big up your chairs. Let's get ready for the famous honk, Nollywood honk. He's done a lot of collaborations with um, the, all the A-list um, actors in Nigeria. Yes, he's not a novice. He's appeared in films like Crazy Love, The Bad Combination, The Warrior Love, Daughter of the Wind, Yahoo Without Pint, uh, My Sister Cannot Be King, The White Priestess, yes, Butterfly Kisses, Money from the Block, and so on and so forth, including uh, he made his debut in 2007 alongside Aki um, Popo. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, uh, it's Junior Pope. Um, we're calling his number. Unfortunately, it wasn't going through. I'm going to try again. Uh, he knows we are interviewing today. I've spoken to him this morning. So, uh, he's also a businessman. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's just get ready for this interview. It's exclusive live on AYO Radio United Kingdom. Yes. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready for Junior Pope. Junior Pope. His phone is ringing, so we're just waiting for him to answer the phone. As soon as he answers, then the interview shall commence. Um, I'm not sure why the phone keeps cutting off. Um, I'm not sure. But, ladies and gentlemen, we just have to keep calling. Um, it could be the network, you know. Sometimes when you call in Nigeria, the phone will be ringing, and uh, you know, uh, unfortunately, uh, it's not actually ringing out to the other person or to the person at the other end. It's also featured in the Rich American Gambler one and two, and uh, also in Dangerous Risk, uh, Dangerous Risk, the Four Lions with Regina Daniels. Um, my only love is now a priestess. Uh, I've said that before. Association of job seekers. <laughs> that should be a funny one. You know. So make sure uh, that you go and watch all these films if you haven't watched it already. Okay? So make sure you go and watch it. They are all great films featuring Junior Pop. Like I said before, he made his debut in 2007 alongside Aki and Popo. That was when he made his debut. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm proud to say to you, Hello. yes, good afternoon. Uh, my name is DJ Ali Journalist. You are live on AYO Radio and it's the role model show. The whole world is watching and listening to you. Hi, uh, how are you doing? Happy Sunday. How are you today? How are you? Oh, well, I'm great. We're in London and London is uh, having traffic chaos now because the London Marathon, that's 10 mile run, is now live. It's live in London. Yeah. Aye? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, ask Nigeria today. Just describe what's happening uh, around you in Nigeria today, sir. Well, it's very sorry to here. Be sorry, Abby. Sorry, just to shake it and uh, it's Sunday and uh, Sunday is which I was responsible to stay in town mm. and uh, avoid the sun. <laughs> yeah, so it's just that. 
I'm just going to go up for the Lord of God. Yes, yes. There's nothing much happening in the country. <laughs> I think I think uh, it's left the decision making to you. You have to rule Nigeria before it comes back. Can you handle yeah, it? Yeah, of course. What, of course. What would you like to change about Nigeria before it comes back? Corruption. Hey. I really think we because for crying out loud, I'm a father of two, mm. and um, sometimes I, I do my investigations. I tend to ask people, mm. why do you get? Why do you have friends who have, who have their kids abroad? Mm. And then they give birth to their kids as well. And I'm like, why do you people go to America and we don't know these countries to have their children? Mm. If it has no future for the Nigerian child. Mm. Mm. So that's the reason you go to America to have your kids for the future. It's the best future for the child. Yeah. So I started to tell me that the children born in Nigeria are doomed. <laughs> yeah, of course. So I if I have my way, I think yeah. I need to do a clean up. Yes. Some of these leaders have to go. Mm. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank yeah. you so much. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, um, the old world, pay attention. This interview is just going to take like 20 minutes now. Uh, we're running uh, out of time. It's very, very fast. We're going to do a chapale chapale because uh, the reason why Junior Pope is here uh, is a role model in our society. Is somebody that all young people and even the older ones should look up to. We want to hear his success story, how he actually got started um, up to uh, the, who he is now. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, a few introduction about, about Junior Pope. Uh, he's a famous actor, model, TV personality and a philanthropist born in Cameroon on the 7th May 1984 but originally from Enugu. Yes, he made his movie debut in 2007 alongside Akina Popo in Secret Adventure. First lead role as Oja DK. Wow, that's very... Um, and in Deeper Than Faces. Crazy Love is featured in it, The Bad Company, The Warrior Love, uh, Daughter of the Wind, Yahoo Without Pint. That one is funny. <laughs> and also, <laughs> my, my brother, you are a great role model. Uh, I'm so honored to actually uh, be speaking to you today. Uh, you've been uh, a role model to me for a very long time and uh, to a lot of young people out there. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, um, the question is going to be chapale, chapale. It's not, uh, okay. we just want to hear your story uh, from beginning. Um, you were born in Cameroon and you are, uh, you are, and you are from a native of uh, Enugu, isn't it? Yeah. You're from Enugu. Tell us about that story. How did you, uh, why were you born in Enugu? Why I was born in Cameroon. In Cameroon, okay, sorry. Why were you born in Cameroon? Sorry, I beg your pardon. Yeah, my sister uh, actually I was doing the war. I mean, by, when the war devastated the country, mm. I mean, uh, my father and my mom had to elope and they left the country for survival yeah. down to Cameroon. And my father found business there. Mm. And they, I mean, he they got himself invested down there oh. and picked up and then started having children. Mm. Uh, so from the family of uh, uh, eight, eight, we are eight, yeah. and there were six, and there were four or five. Mm. So I have older ones. So from there, I came back to Nigeria for university education. Mm. You know, when Cameroon went, uh, or there, I refused to go. Mm. So there was a little chaos in Cameroon, we had to come back to Nigeria. Mm. And in Nigeria, I went to the University of Nigeria in Blue Campus. Mm. And then from there, my girlfriend there is uh, a whole lot. Yeah, she believed in me. Okay. She was the one who gave me the registration fee to go register as an actor. Wow. She was the first person who said, I believe it's you. Wow. Wow. That's, yeah. that's a very, yeah. very good love story. Wow. I like yeah. that. I like that. That's a good start. Wow. I, I'm, I'm just blushing. <laughs> so, do you know, do you know, sometimes, yeah, I, I always say to men, you know, do not treat women badly, you understand, because there are no, good women no. out there who will do anything for the man that they actually love. Love, yeah. This is true story, yeah. I like that. And uh, what age did you leave uh, Cameroon to move to Nigeria? I left Cameroon, I left for university, I was done with, I left, I left at about 
16. Okay, so your yeah. primary, nursery, and uh, secondary education were all in Cameroon? No, primary, nursery, primary, partly secondary. Partly secondary, okay. Okay, yeah. so you, you enrolled in secondary school at the, uh, when you came to Nigeria? Okay, right. So if all your... If all your friends, your old classmates are listening now, if we are fortunate enough and are, if they are, they are fortunate to be alive today as well, um, what, what would they say about you? What activities did you partake in when you were in secondary school? What do they know you as? Oh, well, well in secondary school, uh, back then, you know, the song, I was actually a stage, a performance stage, mm. but I was more of a... Uh, 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 I was minded, mm. you know, I was minded uh, to find points to bed. Wow. And uh, so, uh, yes, I was in love with music. Mm. I was small in love with music and acting, mm. actually. Okay. Yeah. So, uh -huh. are you singing now? Apart from being no. a famous actor, model, TV personality, and philanthropist, do you sing? Uh, for fun, I do. Not for either, Not actually. Mm. It's not for the best. Okay. But, for, yeah. mm. but is it possible for yeah. us, uh, can we be privileged to actually hear your singing voice? Can you mime any song? <laughs> <laughs> you are an actor now. You can do anything. Yeah, you are an actor. You can do anything. Let's hear your voice as a singer. Play a role of a singer. I'm serious. I'll be honored if you do that for me, please. Do that for London. Yeah, do that for London. Do that for London. Just do that for London. For sake of London. And the Queen. Do it for the Queen too. Please. Let's see. Yeah, go on. I listen to Fino. Fino is a great uh, singer. Okay, God, I don't think I need to control. I but everybody they book. My swag will be sure continue to book. <laughs> oh my god, exclusively. <laughs> exclusively you got it. I said to God, that voice is nice, oh brother. That voice is nice. And me as a DJ, I've been a DJ from the age of 16. This year I will be 54 years old. So you can tell wow, I can wow. tell good music when I hear one. I'm telling you, that, that's really good. That's really good. Thank you so much for doing that exclusively. Thank you, bro. Okay, sir. Um, you mentioned that your girlfriend then actually sponsored yeah. your um, acting career. Um, yeah, the first. Te te uh, okay. Um, tell us the conversation that led to it. Where were you? What were you talking about? Why did she believe in you that you can actually uh, act? What is that thing that she actually saw that she said, "Oh, uh -huh. I'm gonna give the guy, this guy, you know, some some money to pursue his uh, dream, dream." Uh, well, that's after I I performed on stage in the university. Mm -hmm. On stage, uh, in the university, I joined a theater group, mm -hmm. Joyful Family Theater Group, mm -hmm. and we had a perform on stage, and I think I played the role of the Herald, yes. Wow. You know, in the church, you know, kind of uh, a theater group. Mm -hmm. So I, I played the role of King Herald. Mm -hmm. So when one candidate called, long candidate the deck, mm -hmm. when we were having this conversation, I was like, oh, well, you can take this thing to the next level, why don't you? And I was like, I was, I was listening, you know? Mm. Until she got her 7,000 Naira, mm. that I should not register. And I went and registered on that, the late kids mm. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and how did it go? When you register, what happened next? Oh, when I got registered, it was a funny thing. I actually came that period mm. to study the, uh, the, 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 uh, to study the Bollywood, to study Bollywood. Mm. So I came to know that I was studied by a role model mm -hmm. when I registered. It wasn't easy at all. Mm -hmm. So I started to discover that in the business or in uh, the career mm -hmm. as an actor, mm -hmm. we had a lot of a lover, love, love actors. Okay. We had 
challenges that you faced as an up-and-coming actor then, right? But I think you've just mentioned one. Number one would be finance. Number two, uh, that you you actually had many fishes in the pond, isn't it? Yeah. yeah but a lot of celebrities out there, so you, mm. you need to, you need to, you, you discover mm. that you need to do your homework mm. to be able to break it. Mm. Yes, it's not easy at all. It wasn't easy. It's mm. not easy to do this. Mm. Because everybody is speaking English. Mm. I mean, yes. everybody asks. Yes. So what is that audience? What is that extra? Mm. And that's your picking into the food. Mm. So I have to go back home and do it by, by own work. Mm. Yeah. Um, yeah. Like so it. I like it back. Like he mentioned that, yeah, there are finance and uh, many actors, great actors who are there as well. Those are the two challenges. Yes. I'm going to kill. Yes. Uh, I'm going to kill one bed with two stones now. Uh, number one, what um, what other skills or what other thing that is unique about you that you actually brought to the movie industry and any other challenges apart from many actors in there and their finance any other challenges so those are the two questions what is unique about you that actually got you noted or um brought you to the limelight what was good about you apart from the good look i hope you are going to Bring uh, you are going to mention good look because you are actually good looking. <laughs> no, it's true now. Why are you the lab, bro? I know they watch that. It's in your resume. You are you are a model. You understand? Apart from that good look, I know it's a it's a contributor contributory factor. Um, I won't speak bad English there, but God save me, uh, What other challenges and what is unique about you when you are breaking? Well, I say two things. I think. I, I asked for what was discovered in the unique part of it. I think my voice oh, and also yes. my craziness. Craziness? Craziness that it, it's the food. Mm. Yes, it was out of the block. Mm. It was something nobody, nobody had seen. Mm. You know, because when I came, I, I don't think Jemai had the swag. Mm. I think he was the only one with the swag. Mm. But I discovered I could do my own swag in a crazy, in a bad man's way wow. of life. Yes, yes. You know, she might wear me and it, but you don't put it on the peg. The peg you use to handle your clothes. Mm. I put it on my ear. She might wear good shoes. You'll be a bushman. You'll be a bushman. Yeah. She might wear good shoes, but I wear different legs of shoes to be very hollow. Oh, you know, wow. Too different. Wow. Too totally different. Wow. You know, it's about to be a. Wow. Uh, you wear the trousers lovely. Mm. I take the front, my trousers and the front to the back. Wow! Yeah, I have to do something different, yeah? Yeah, crazy. Yeah, something crazy. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, because that's what stood out in the, the, the food. Mm. Yeah, what about, yeah. Other, what about other challenges apart from uh, finance and uh, uh, many great actors in the industry already? Uh, let's see. Well, you know, it takes a lot, a lot, actually. It takes a long time for somebody to believe in you. Mm -hmm. So this, uh, the financiers of this, mm -hmm. of this movie, mm -hmm. uh, not, it's not, uh, it's not, these are like, like the, uh, uh, individuals. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It, yeah, so it takes, uh, it gets mm -hmm. up So the one of the challenges is somebody to believe in you. It's billions in you mm. that you're going to deliver. Mm. Uh, it's, 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 it's a tough one. Oh. Yeah, you have 
to we have to really bring out the gift you need to be able to convince this particular person. Okay. Um, let me give a shout out to the people who are just joining us now. Um, Kenneth, uh, Ash, I'm sorry, that name is very difficult for me. Kenneth Ibradu Ike, sorry. And Kingsley, Kingsley Igo Vie. Sorry, I can't pronounce it. I'll just go by the first name. Sorry, ladies and gents. Uh, uh, Kingsley, Kingsley, thanks for joining us. Uh, Kenneth, thank you so much. And to those of you who are just joining us, uh, I have the pleasure of talking to, um, with me now, Mr. Junior Pope is a famous actor in Nigeria, Nollywood in industry, is a model, TV personality, and philanthropist. Uh, he came to the industry, according to what I'm gathering now, with a unique skill, talent, apart from the good look, his voice. He sounds like uh, Barry White to me, very sexy <laughs> voice, you know, and then he came with a different swag, which um, all the actors did not have so he brought it into the into the industry are you like that in real life too well sometimes it is yes yeah, it is the originality mm. originality works for me mm. i just did there was a location i went to mm. you know my my sister i mean in Kubi, mm. Kubi mm. she did a, a show with the suka i was there with two different legs of shoes <laughs> I was on my head. And everybody was like, this guy is crazy, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. You're different. Yeah, this is who I am. Mm. You know, sometimes yeah. crazy in a good way. That's who you are. You are crazy, but in yeah. a good way. In a swaggy, yeah. swaggalicious way. Yeah. yeah. And um, since you've started, you've um, worked along so many famous actors and actresses. Um, can you name a few of them? And... Um, yeah, just name a few of them. Well, well, a few, okay. I'm going to start with uh, Olu Jacobs, Uncle Pete Edoche, Okebo Wo, Sophia Ifaibu, Lavita Ibae Hupadu, Mukoni Wa Suka, Rachel Okuoko, yeah. Uh, a lot of the, the Regina Daniels, the, did you mention Regina Daniels? Oh yeah, Regina Daniels, our very first movie, Death to the Child. She was just a little girl, I mean, she was very just you know. Yeah, yeah now Kichara, I'm shocked, it's almost all the actors you can think of. And mm. fact of the ones who were not there when I gave it. Mm. What about Ini Edo? Ini Edo, very well. Yeah, Very well. That's good. So, from um, uh, could have the jungle with her, mm. shot the uh, Kathy with her, mm. you know. Mm. Yeah, um, we've got a quick book cool here, mm. yeah, Betty Johnson, mm. yeah, a lot of mm. events. Mm. Well, I to be well, I got out, I got to be still today, mm. but first we well, I got to be well. Mm. And these are, yes. these are my favorite movies that you've done that I really, really like. You know, Secret Adventure, and oh, yeah. Crazy Love. Bad Combination, yeah. The Warrior, The Warrior Love, yes, Daughter of the Wind, yeah. Yahoo Without Pines. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> I, wa I watch it with my kids, I'm telling you, the loudest than the yeah. general movie. And, uh, I've got I've got two daughters. One is twenty five years old. She's a journalist and an author. And the second one, she's a psychiatrist, um, doctor at a hospital. Yeah. She said she said when we were watching it, she said, "Oh, that guy is cute, didn't he?" I said, "Be sure, no, shut up." <laughs> <laughs> I jealous die. I jealous die. <laughs> and butterfly kisses. Money from the block, the white yeah. priestess. Yeah. Um, can you remind me any other movies? I know I'm missing a lot because your resume is just too long for me to read out all the movies. Can you wow, remind? Wow. Can you remember yeah. every, anything? You have a lot. I, I, I was a lot count. Yeah, I know. I've done more than a hundred movies. I know. My credit. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, but, uh, I've done a lot, a lot. I just mm. can't start now. Mm. When you when you when you when you going to do these movies, I understand from the people that I've interviewed in the past. I've interviewed Timaya, many or many other okay. actresses. Um, I can't even remember, including the Nollywood twins as well. Um, 
You go to movies, to locations, sometimes, you know, you spend one day, two days, three days and more. Do you not miss yeah. home? That's a busy life, isn't it? Do you not miss home? That's the question I want to ask you. Do you not miss home sometimes when you're at location? Well, of course. Of course I do, but you know, but I knew. I console myself with the fact that I'm happy to be here hustling, mm. the deals will be paid. Yeah. I can't hustle for the deals to be paid. Mm. Of course I do be so I got my two boys and I need them so much. I love them so much. I get more mm. my family like crazy. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Mm. So I do be so but one guy has got to hustle. Mm. The the economy here for the year I do a little more. Mm. Yeah. And so we got to quadruple our hustle. Yeah, but like I said, the list of your movies, the movies that you featured is, is endless. Um, so let's just assume, let's just assume that you've done uh, 200 movies, yeah? Which means yeah. you've gone, I'm not very good in maths, so, but assuming that you, you've gone out of your house, gone to different locations more than 200 times, that is a lot. How do you feel? It is, it is. That's a lot. You left it is. more well, than 200 people. Hmm. When I was screaming for Professor John Poo for Drew, yeah. I go for one book. Mm. What? Yeah, one book, two I come. I leave my house for one book. I'm in a hotel. Wow. <laughs> Without seeing your kids, without sitting at your favorite chair at home. You know, we all have favorite yeah. chair in our houses, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Does that not drive yeah, you crazy? Or what's the, what's the boss about leaving home and going to location? Sometimes you go to, you go to the wilderness to act where there are wild animals, snakes, scorpions, and yeah, the one I just finished is an epic movie. You need to see my body. Mm. My body is all full of a lot of insects, bites, and mosquito bites, mm. and it's eating like crazy. Wow. Yeah, mm. exactly. My body, I'm not talking to you right now, eating. Wow. My body so... everywhere, eating mosquitoes and fat flies. Maybe those mosquitoes, yeah. maybe they are your fans too. You understand? Maybe yeah. that's why they beat you. <laughs> like I've seen my hero. My hero is in the bush with me. Come on, all fellow mosquitoes, let's yeah. let's go and hug him. <laughs> Thank God for that. Um, okay, we're going to move very, very swiftly because Tam is not on our side. Um, um, do you have a favorite? You know, sometimes they say it's not good to have a uh, favorite children. You understand? But do you have a favorite yeah. child and a favorite yeah. movie? So I'm asking two favorite questions. Child. No, favorite child, favorite yeah. movie. Favorite movie that I've done or... Yeah, yeah that you've done. Yeah. That you featured in, uh, or produce, or I don't know. Uh, one of my, I, I I don't have a favorite child. I I love my kids equally. Mm -hmm. uh, but for favorite movie, mm -hmm. uh, uh, wow, 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 wow! I I just I don't think I do have. I uh, don't think so. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much for joining us today. Yes, um, thank you, my brother. the reason why we're here is for you to use your influence as an uh, A-class celebrity, an actor, model, and uh, um, a TV personality. Actually, let's just hit this one, Shapale, Shapale, if we can just, if you can answer these questions uh, in one minute. Um, acting, modeling, TV uh, personality, and uh, philanthropist. Quickly uh, tell us, how did all this uh, happen? How do you cope as one person doing all this four stuff? And I'm, and I'm sure that you are a family man, which is another five, you understand? And so many things that you do. How do you cope? What keeps you going? What exactly keeps you going doing all this? Well, yeah, well, like you said, it won't be late. Uh, I think I where you find your passion. Mm. I think I found my passion. My passion is when I think the camera. Mm. Whenever I think the camera happens to be one of my happiest moments in life. Mm. And as regards that, when I think the camera, I get paid. Mm. And when I get paid, the philanthropic part of it comes to play. Mm. When I, where I have to give back to the society, that I've given a lot to me. Mm. So I go back home, every 
Actually asking, what's your favorite food, color, holiday city or country, book or president in the world? Okay, my favorite what, what's the first? Okay, I'll mention it one by one. Food. Okay. Favorite food? Okay, I'll pass that here and I go see. Chai, can you cook? No, 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 so I can't even want food. <laughs> Yes, man, or it. <laughs> what we put, you just have to put it in the, in the microwave. Ah, oh, you're funny. I like that. <laughs> What's your favorite color, sir? Favorite color, white. White. I like white too. Yeah. Nice one. Yeah. You will see, the whole world will be wearing white because you said it now. They want to copy you. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's white, we have this Yeah, yeah. It's pure. Yeah. Um, what about holiday city or country? Where would you like to go on holiday? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can hear you. I can hear you. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that would be that nice. Would be that would be nice. Any particular reason? I know, just for the fun of it. Mm. For the fun of it. Mm. And also for my children to be educated. Okay. My father told me that uh, family is another age of mm. education. Mm. 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 Anything yeah. else that you learned from your parents? Anything else that you've learned from your parents? For my parents? Yeah, from I them. think they really learned to take the godliness. Wow. Wow. I wish yeah. I've got that. I, I wish I've got that. My wife has got it, but me, I'm a messy person. But she's got OCD. You know, OCD. Um, oh, yeah, obsessive. Yeah, I I too. Obsessive. You, got, you have OCD. <laughs> yeah, I do. I love it, you know. Sometimes my wife doesn't come into my room. Hey! I don't, I you don't are know. bad, oh. <laughs> You're bad, oh. <laughs> Do you know what? I love OCD, too. You know, my house is very clean. People come to me, they, they glorify me, but I said, no, don't thank me, thank the madam. Even, I can't remember, we've been married for over 25 years, I can't remember the last time I actually cleaned the house or hoover it. Because I tried it before in the beginning. After I've hoovered the house, yeah, she, five minutes later, she will do it again. So I just said, what's the point? You love cleaning. You must well handle the cleaning. I love OCD. I don't care what yeah. anybody says. But some people say it's bad. Is this? No, I like it. I like. I love it. The way sh people put things in order. You put understand? Things in order. Mm. Put things together. Wow, I like that. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Are you going to pass this experience to your children as well? Yes, I've tried. I've tried. I've started already. Mm. I've started. Nice one. Yeah. I think my father also had it. Uh, my father does have it, you know, so I think it's also part of me. Mm, yeah. Thank you. And what about the house with mm. empty clothes in the laundry? Mm. I don't complete outside. Mm. Yes, I see how there's this thing of noise about the house there, you know. Mm. So until that, those clothes are washed mm. and then, uh, you know, iron and, mm. and everything is clean. So that's good. What's your worst side of OCD though? What's your worst side? My wife's worst side is when you come into the house, you have to take your shoes off. Okay. I don't know. Like if I have to put the shoe right here, mm. if they said, don't move it. <laughs> don't move it. <laughs> I'm coming to your house, I will come and move it one day. Sometimes I could take my bed and lie on the floor. 
Okay. Why? What's the reason? Yes. Ross, Ross, Ross. Do you know what? Son? Do you know what? I like you a lot. I swear to God, I like you. Do you know you should you should do a movie about that? You know, you 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 make your bed neat, yeah, and you're supposed to lie on it, but you went to lie on the floor. <laughs> that is funny. Where the girl just got that? Where the girl that got that? Ross, I'm lonely. I'm lonely. I've never had. I've never laughed so hard until now. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, let's finish this. Um, what about fav favorite book and president in the world? Okay, well, uh, favorite book. Mm. I used to love uh, uh, Forty Eight Laws of Power. Mm. Yes, I used to love the book. The favorite president of the world. Mm, in the world. I, uh, 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 in three, I don't know. You in don't three. know that. Mm. That's me. That's me. That's me. Who? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah. That's very good. Okay. Um, um, is there anything that you would like all your fans to know more about you? Maybe something that you are cooking now, or you know, anything at all that okay. you might think uh, nobody has ever, you know, known about you. Well, yeah, maybe uh, I've always been. Uh, Boxing and football and wrestling. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. I don't do much of uh, football because the if I play with the uh, with the, the computer, the computer it makes me upset. So I don't <laughs> like someone with it all the time. <laughs> <laughs> but what, what, why don't you play with the children? Why don't you play with the children? I play with my kids. They beat me all the time. Okay, well, but my kid, my first is just fight. Mm. He's just getting used to you know getting to this. Thing. Yeah, that's fine. I don't want it to be all give, give, give. Let him read his book. Nasu, Nasu, Nasu. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, we're rounding up now. Um, I you. want you, please, to speak to young people all over the world. This is the main aspect of this program. Okay. Uh, the reason why I've actually created is I love young people. Like I said, I'm 54 years old. Uh, thank God I managed to raise my kids. They were born here in the UK where we are currently experiencing a lot of knife attacks. 
love murder, yeah. drug, yeah. everything is happening, uh, even kidnapping. Nowadays, they will kidnap your kid and you will never see I your kid for a while. They will go and groom them as drug dealers, as prostitutes. That is happening in this country. And we have fraud, you know, the famous fraud. Uh, and then, yeah. you know, the Yahoo boys are there in Nigeria yeah. and all over the world. You know, there are lots of uh, things that cry, I mean, Courtesy, atrocities. yeah, atrocities, that's the word, thank you very much for putting that in my mouth. Yeah. Atrocities that young people are dabbling into. We want to encourage them that you are not like that. You are a famous actor. You are a model. You are a TV personality. You are a philanthropist. You know, you had choices. You could have done, gone into crime, but you face careers. And this is what... We've known you as, and we look up to you. Please encourage them. Talk to their life now. Well, uh, I, you know, they say uh, if you pick up a child the way he should grow, when he grows up, mm. he will not depart from it. So I believe that our parents will do their deeds. Mm. When they must have done their deeds, it is left for us as adults mm. to choose our path in life. Yes. And as such, when you talk about what I've been through in life, mm -hmm. I wouldn't be talking to you, young ones out there, as if I have a faith. Mm -hmm. But right now, now yes. there's something you've done that I've not done. Yes. When you're talking about autism in school, I was yes. once a cousin. Yes, me too. A very good guy, mm -hmm. as a matter of fact. Me too. When you talk about Yahoo, we start Yahoo. Mm -hmm. You know, so there's absolutely nothing that there is that I've not done. Mm -hmm. I've fled the police there for God knows how long. But this thing kept on bringing shit to my family. Yes. I'd almost killed my mother mm. of high blood pressure. Yeah. And then at some point, I discovered that along the line, it was not nothing to do with prayer. Mm. But I told myself the truth, mm. that I am not hurting only myself. Mm. I'm also hurting the people around me. Yes, sir. I mean, how can I make these parents of mine who almost gave their life raising me, how can I make their proud? Mm. Is it my biggest shame and bad day to the family? Mm. Absolutely no. Yes, and as such, I pulled out from Yahoo. Mm. When I also discovered how the Yahoo Yahoo boys end up. Yes, sir. Too bad, a lot of them don't end up well. Yes, sir. Even if they don't end, even if they end up making all the riches, mm. both them making one way or the other, I have seen their children. Mm. I have yes, seen sir. how the thing ends up affecting their kids. Yes, sir. I don't want to call this, but I made my investigation. And when I discovered this thing, I sat down and said, there's absolutely nothing as good as clean money. Hmm. I drive home to my house, I drive home to my kids, I've never looked behind my mirror and somebody is coming after me. Yes, because I didn't take anybody's money. Yes, sir. I dropped my sweat to make my one dinner. Preach. Which is why if I drop one dinner, I consider my dignity too. Preach. Now, if you keep doing Yahoo Yahoo, one way or the other, plus you don't collect the money. Yes, sir. One way or the other, they will find you. Yes, sir. Hate it or love it, it will come back. But yes. I wasn't the one who said, what goes around comes around. It Preach. will find you. Preach. It may not be the person to whom you took his money. But one way or the other, what that feeds you, you drop on the ground to tell you this. That feed will grow. So I sat down, I read a lot of books, watch a lot of movies, mm. and I discovered that this is life. Mm. The life itself is what goes around, comes around. Yes. You saw a wonderful seed, it will generate my father. Definitely. My father is an example. Mm. My father sweat, he, he, he raised eight children, medical mm. doctors included. Yes. And we have them in America, have brothers and sisters in America. God. Medical doctors. Mm. Now my father is old. He's now sick. Mm. If, for instance, he did not raise this kid mm. properly, I believe by now he would have passed on. Yes. But because he raised his children well, they said, Come over, father. Mm. He decided to look after you. Mm. Yeah, so now that is the point where I'm trying to. I said, We all need quick money. Mm. Nobody needs quick money like me. But with time, everything will be pure. With time, everything will be. We cannot blame our government for everything. Yes, there are other legit jobs we can do out there. But God knows our government have failed us. Mm. This we cannot do to Allah. Sleep under the carpet. Mm. 
they have our leaders are they will die well as a matter of fact. Amen. Amen. Say, because if you follow me on Twitter, I say you say mm. how can one person own 15 uh, 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 automobiles in this compound? Mm. One person. Mm. And our hospitals are not one, it's not 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 where people go to uh, to be uh, to get well. Mm. Our prison, prisons, uh, the prison yards are not letting people go for rehabilitation. Yes. The country is totally dead. Yes. It's our leaders are out there buying property, investing this money in other countries. I, for one, believe in Nigeria. Mm. I believe in this country. Yes. For crying out loud, I was not so great out when I came here. I believe this country can be better again. Yes, but it is not going to take the effort of one person to take our general culture as an effort. What? So what? please, people, don't do do. There's no fast money. Girl, she's going to prostitution to buy your hair. Hmm. I thought that you don't need. Hmm. And I speak with you right now using the Docker touch. Preach. I know my priorities. You need to set your priorities right. Yes. And if you were raised up well, peer pressure is not going to affect you. Yes. You cannot use your physical world to compare somebody's physical to it. Yes. And because when, when, when you, you do believe in yourself, if you believe in yourself and trust your God, yes. keep it time, all this thing is time. Mm. I went through this kind of thing. I left my parents, I know how old. I left them. And I started pursuing this career. Preach. And this is who I am now. The world knows me. What? So I speak to you people, please. I mean, but one thing I need you all to know, if you do the, the crime, you will do the time. Yes. That is one thing you need to know. Yes. You steal from somebody, you stab somebody, you do. My brother, my sister, you will do the time. It will come. Yes. I am not preaching. I'm not a preacher. I'm not a reality. Yes. I see these things happen in reality. What? I have friends who have gone to sell their hands in places. Mm. What small accidents will happen? They don't die. But hey. so you see people whose hands are clean. They have to talk to three times, they'll come out and they'll just walk out. Yes. I yes. see these things happen. Yes. So why will I swallow my hands? Yes. Why will I set somebody's pants mm. to be free? Mm. Why will I cut one girl's dress yes. to be rich? When I know that, yes, I can be rich without doing this thing. Yes, sir. I hope I've spoken to somebody today because it is far better to fail in originality than to succeed in imitation. Wow. Give yourself time. I love that phrase. I love the end of it. Oh my God, from the beginning, I was moved. I'm telling you. I, I need wiper for my glasses now. Tear is running down. You are a powerful orator. I'm telling you. Thank you, you are a brother. powerful Thank orator. Okay. Uh, two things that I want you to do now. Talk about uh, Enoku. I want you to talk about the culture, the food, the marriage, the language. I want you to talk okay. about that. And then finish it up with prayer. And then we call it a day, sir. Thank you so much. Um, okay. uh, let me let me make a speech to you. I really, really yeah. love you. I love your um, I love your speech right now, and Thank I'm you. and I'm Thank I'm you. going to be using this speech all the time on this station because I Thank want you. you to enter all the children's ears and stay there, yeah. not come out from the left ears. They need to be hearing this. All the time, every day. Thank you so much. Now finish by telling, um, because we are based in the UK, I want uh, I want yeah. to sell Enugu culture to everyone yeah. to come to Enugu and experience Enugu, yeah. whether for the first time, second time, or all the time. Talk about their culture, yeah. their food, their marriage, and their beautiful language. Okay. Well, I'm from Enugu Okay. In a good state, mm. a beautiful place, in a place. Uh, a good state is in the hands of God, like we probably we uh, we see. And uh, well, uh, in a good state, in your county, mm. top five states where you can raise your children, you can raise your kids. Wow. A good state should be included in that list. Wow. It is a very beautiful place. The people are very welcoming, hospitable people. Mm. And uh, you talk 
about their food. Oh my God. Mm. When you look at our father as we get to the age of 90, mm. 80, 1900, mm. you will wonder how. My brother like this time. Mm. They go shoot the cousin. Mm. You go to it, they have it all. They have the abu, they have the attack. And then they don't do much of gear and spirit. You have to go up and Mm. Raw from the you know from the pantry yes. down straight to your 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 throat and then your food. Yes. You know. So they have the culture of the people that are also as far diversity I mean it's 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 it, it, like a basket. We have the, the we talk about the basket mm. I mean because sometimes I go down there mm. The my place to uh, attend these festivals. Yes. We have a lot of festivals, we have the cool people, mm. we have the DK people, mm. we have different festivals, mm. but they are very, very entertaining. Wow. You know, but, uh, we talk about the bike, we don't want to buy cool. I don't think it's very effective because uh, I don't think they are dressed in any more out there. But it is still the cool city state. Mm. It is a lot of beautiful state. The state where uh, uh, Utuku actually, I think, had his first house, wow. and uh, the state of heroes. Wow. Yes, yes. Wow. Uh, that's my state, the state mm. of Okolima, Sukatu, the state of uh, uh, the, the living in bondage, mm. uh, uh, hero, mm. Kenneth of Oko. Wow, yes, yes, yes. From, I remember him, yes. The famous, the famous Kenneth of Oko, yes. The famous Kenneth Okoko, yes, yes. it was there. Mm -hmm. Also, uh, Sophia, so of Edwin State, Chiwowo, Babaji. Wow. Yes, we are all Edugu mm -hmm. <laughs> So, Great. Edugu State is in the heart of God, it's a beautiful place. Mm -hmm. So, raise your kids, welcome to everybody. Welcome to Christ, then I don't think there's crime in Edugu State. Mm -hmm. Because the governor would rule you as we do in Christ. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a uh, successor. Mm. This all family well. Mm. Uh, he picked up from where his previous stage has left off. Yes. And the stage you need to you all need to visit the new stage whenever you visit Nigeria. Thank you very much for that. Now round it up with prayer, please. Well, I would say that I would round it up uh, with a prayer for our fisher that God should all uh, help our leaders, give them the foresight to understand that the future belongs to the children. And also, they should concentrate their efforts to rehabilitate, to cater, to love, yes, to school, to protect these children. Yes, Lord. And, uh, Amen. yes, and, uh, uh, may God give them the strength and uh, foresight to Amen. do so. Amen. In Jesus' name, and we, the citizens, also have patience for our leaders, because I'm very sure they are all not bad, just like in the police force. Mm. Where we have the bad egg and the good egg. That's right. We yes. pray that God, in His infinite mercy, will show Nigeria mercy. Mm -hmm. For He has blessed this country yes. with all its mineral resources. Yes. The country is extremely rich. Yes, Lord. But what we have is bad leaders. Yes. Nigeria, at some point, was richer than Dubai. Yes. But right now, Nigeria is no place compared to Dubai. Mm. But Father Lord, sometimes we don't understand what is going on, mm. but we put our trust in You. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you so much for coming on this show today. Uh, today is Thank one you. of my greatest days on earth. I'm so happy talking to you. And I want to Thank reveal, you. they always say, as a journalist, they say we mustn't emotionally carried away with anything we're doing, but I was emotionally carried away uh, because uh, uh -huh. you're my hero. You know, sometimes you have Thank to forget you. about profession. You're a human being first, yeah. you understand? Yeah. So I really uh -huh. enjoy talking to you today, and I'm sure Thank that you. you've touched the lives of a lot of people, not just young and the older generations as well. There are lots of comments on the Facebook. Yes, there are lots of comments on the Facebook, but I, I just ignore yeah. them. But I will send some comments to you so that you can have a look okay. later. On. Okay, sir. Okay. Thank Which you so, so much. much. I beg God just to leave you with this yes. that I don't want to leave Ed mm. and my name goes off. I want to leave Ed and my name will be remembered. Mm. Like that the ITQ way. He lives forever. Yes. That is one of, my, one of my reasons to be who I am today. Mm. Thank you. Thank you very much. You have a lovely Sunday, sir. You too.
go. Send my love to all the family as well. Thank you, sir. Okay, I will. Bye -bye. Thank you. Cheers. Bye. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for listening and uh, watching um, the interview on the Raw Monday Show. My name is DJ Ali, journalist, a.k.a. Metal Up Junior, a.k.a. Omayara Durani Mango Ro, a.k.a. African Boy with Charisma, a.k.a. Metal Up Junior, yes. Yes, you've just listened to my exclusive interview with the Nollywood actor, very famous actor, model, TV personality, and philanthropist, Junior Pope Odonduodo. Odonduodo, I hope I'm pronouncing that very well. Yes, uh, Junior Pope was born in Cameroon, but originally from Enugu State. He was born on the 7th of May, 1984, and uh, he's done lots of movies his debut actually started from 2007 when he featured alongside Aki and Popo in Secret Adventure his first lead role was as Ojadike Ojadike in Deeper Than Faces he's done many many movies including Money From The Block Butterfly Kisses, The White Prestest, Prettiest, Prettiest, yeah, Prettiest, wow. My Sister Can Never Be King, Yahoo Without Pant, Daughter of the Wind, The Warrior Love, The Bad Combination, Crazy Love, and so, so many river tears is included. I'm telling you, this guy is a hero. You heard what he had to say to young people all around the world. Please, ladies and gentlemen, do good and good will follow you. If you do bad, that's what we call boomerang. We come back and heal hard. You end up in prison, jail, or probably be killed. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, my future guest on AYO Radio will be um, do you remember uh, Olawale, the guy who won famous uh, something famous fame project famous something like that and became a taxi driver? He's gonna be here very soon. We are sorting that one. And uh, Whiskey, Davido, many many other guests will be here, ladies and gentlemen. Keep it locked on the Raw Motor Show with DJ Alibaba and the Forty Thieves. Yes, let me take me. Thank you so much for watching. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we're switching to tuning radio. Um, moment we go will be coming up at two o'clock. Hey, 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 hey.
Fast Lives, an informative, educative, and entertaining program where we treat different topics that affect our social lives. The program is of two segments. In the first segment, we treat topics that affect our social lives. In the second segment, we bring out questions from the topic of discussion for our audience to make their own contributions and suggestions. Join your humble presenter and see better as it brings to you trending topics that affect our social lives every week. From your best companion, AYO Radio, broadcasting live in UK and Nigeria at www.ayoradiouk.com. Search lives. You can't afford to miss it. Yes, if you're just joining us, you've missed our exclusive interview with Nollywood Hong actor John Junior Pope. Yes, on AYO Radio, on the Role Model Show. 